explosion in Rob Robbins lab. Was she in it? Well, I asked to see her that night, you know, I wanted to I wanted to thank her. I'm so sorry. I felt the explosion, Carly. She made me stay in bed and she wanted to go see what happened and then when she came back I could tell that she was that she was upset. She said there was an explosion in the lab and I immediately asked about Robin and that's when my head started to hurt and Sam told me Robin was fine. And she was trying to protect you. I knew something was wrong. But I, I thought Robin didn't have the drugs ready, so, you know, I asked to see Robin because I wanted her to let me go home. Sam was, um, desperately trying to keep you calm. And, and pretty soon after that, Sam said the drug was ready, and then... Then Patrick came in to talk to me about the procedure, and, and he said something about Robin being gone. She was, she was already dead by then. What do you tell me? Sam wouldn't let me tell you. When, when Patrick did my procedure, he knew Robin was dead. Why, why would he do that for me? He did it for Robin. She found the medicine to save you. He wanted to finish what she started. Do they know what caused the explosion? The news said it was some kind of a gas leak. I mean, Robin couldn't get out. But there were a bunch of little things. Okay, I, I just... I need to know what happened. Patrick discovered the gas leak, so... He went into the lab, and I don't know, it was some kind of chemical spill, and he passed out, and then Robin found him, and she got him out. Okay, so they were outside the lab. Why did, why did Robin go back in? There was some kind of an emergency lock on the door. And I guess once the chemical spill got bad, the door, yeah, she got locked in there. Why did Robin go back in? Because her medicine was in there. So Robin died trying to save me. Robin went back in for that drug because she's a doctor and you're her patient and that meant something to her. And you're her friend and that means even more. She shouldn't have taken the chance. Jason, don't blame yourself. Hey, Robin doesn't deserve that. She made a choice to save you. But you need to honor that. I didn't even get a chance to say goodbye. I'm so sorry. What about the funeral? It's today. The Queen of Angels. I have to be there. The patient that was here, Mr. Her... Where's Jason? Harley, what have you done? What anyone who really knew Jason would have done, Sam. I told him Robin was dead. Where's Jason? He went to her funeral. If it's not too late.
killed you. I can explain. You lied to me. Only because I knew the truth would hurt you. Why didn't you tell me? Why didn't you tell me Robin was dead? I was going to tell you. I was just waiting for the right time. The right time? How about all the time? How about all the times I asked to see Robin? None of those times are right. I mean, after the explosion, you went to see if anybody was hurt. You came back. You said everything was fine, but you already knew that Robin was dead. I found Patrick outside the lab. He tried to go back in, but it was already so, too late. So you came back and you lied to me? You were dying, Jason. I mean, seizure after seizure and always when you were upset. How many times did Patrick say that I had to keep you calm? How calm would you have been if I told you about Robin? Robin died because she went back into the lab for me. Yes, Jason, if you had died, it would have been for nothing. Another reason why I didn't tell you, aside from the fact that I didn't want to lose my husband, I wanted to make sure that... Robin's sacrifice was worth it. It wasn't. Robin would have wanted you to be a father. She would have wanted you to be a part of our child's life. Robin had people to live for, too. Yes, I know. I know, Jason. I am so sorry. You have to understand that I was so scared. I didn't, I didn't know what to do. I mean, the thought of losing you. This baby growing up without feeling your arms around him or, or her, never feeling your heartbeat or never knowing what it's like to feel loved by you. I'm sorry, Jason. I couldn't live with that. I made the only choice that I knew how. your choice to make. You're angry that I lied, and I don't... No, I'm angry because you kept lying. After the procedure, you knew I was okay. I knew you were alive, Jason, and I wanted to keep it that way. When Monica said I was fine. Monica backed me up when I didn't want to tell you about Robin. Everyone wanted to yeah, make sure you were... Yeah, everybody, everybody was in on it, right? Molly, Alexis. Yes, they all knew. Yeah. They knew, but I begged them, Jason, not to tell so you. So the only one who told me the truth was Carly. Yeah, your good friend Carly, who didn't care if she risked your life. She didn't care if you Carly died. Carly couldn't stand Jason. Robin. She told me because I had the right to know. She told you because she was proving a point. As always, she thinks she knows you better than I do. Maybe she does.